this is my cottage for the week. A beautiful thatched cottage with my own hammock and my own desk. And now I'm going down to the Arabian Ocean. A beautiful way to start your morning. All night long, I can hear the waves of the sea really refreshing and relaxing. Here's my favorite spot on the swing. Uh, this is a yoga platform for our outside yoga practice. We'll come in a little bit closer to see the sea. There's uh, the watchmen who make sure that <clears throat> the resort is always safe. Beautiful waves. Luxurious foliage. Some of the guests. Now we're walking toward the dining area. Again, some more beautiful views. Some traditional transportation. In the background, you can see the beach of Kerala and all the fishing boats lined up for work. This is the outside dining area. And in the evenings, there's wonderful music presentations, different classical instruments of India. Here we have the view of some more of the cottages. Coconut trees all around and beautiful gardening. Here we have some of the local residents, the crows. In the morning, I'm awakened by the call of peacocks. Not like a, not like a rooster call, but similar. <laughs> It'll wake you up in the morning, but I can't think of a nicer way to wake up. Now we're walking toward reception, and uh, this is the dining room. There's a full buffet of 60 to 70 different dishes every day, full service restaurant. And um, this is a uh, Varpu, a traditional very large cooking pot that was used in ancient days and now serves as a, a flower display ornament. And uh, here you see the entrance to the resort and the guardsmen and the reception area. Here's some of the wonderful cleaning ladies who come every day for cleaning. And there's shots. Good morning. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> bye bye. They're going on their daily cleaning. Not only do they clean the rooms, but they sweep the lawn so there's not even a leaf out of place. And um, there's shops uh, if you want to do some shopping. Uh, this one's currently closed but you can see some of the masonry ware or statues that are for sale. Uh, there's also an Ayurvedic shop and um, other ways to spend your time during the day. Or if you wish, you can go for a swim in the beach. Uh, I took advantage of this quite a bit. Uh, the Indian Ocean is quite warm and uh, it's pretty exciting to be in the waves 
and they have a lifeguard so he always keeps you in line and makes sure that you're safe. <clears throat> Here you can see the beach. Here's the pool. The pool's very refreshing. Um, yeah, full service, towels, shower, changing rooms, lawn chairs, beautiful view while you're swimming. But I have to confess that my favorite is swimming in the sea. Currently there's nobody swimming. Uh, the sea's been rather rough the last few days because of uh, wind and some rain. Uh, you reach the sea by a path that comes down this way. Really, it can't be compared here. Uh, it's not heaven. It's, uh, I think it's close to paradise, really. So, I hope you can join me someday and come and experience the hospitality, the warmth, the excellent treatment available at this clinic and its sister clinics <clears throat> all around in Kerala. And um, I guess I'll conclude with this. Thanks for taking the tour. Okay, namaste. One more view of the ocean. Or sea, sorry.